coach, congratulations. Uh, this game is 0 but it feels like a win to me. I don't know what it feels like to you. Talk us through the game. Well, it was a game that, um, you know, with some ups and down emotion. I mean, obviously, Bonnie ended up getting a red card, which when we look at it, it wasn't really a red card. So, you know, but the, the game itself, the girls were fantastic. They followed the game plan to a T. You know, France is a fantastic team and they, they're good in the wide areas and the plan was to, how can we stop them from, you know, destroying us in the wide areas and our wide players, you know, that's why Den Den was man of the match. She actually, our wide players were very good and um, again, it's, you know, it's a good team we play and I think we just stick to our task and get it done. You mentioned then, then she had a fantastic game right through, and clearly, as I said, she was voted uh, player of the game. Um, then, then, tell me what you feel about how, how she played. I just think she, I mean, her training leading up all the way from Jamaica, all the way through, she's been doing a good job training, mm -hmm. and um, just knowing from where she's coming from in the last World Cup. You know, so she she she's a very good listener, and I thought she followed the game plan to a T. When we when when we train, she executed to very very well, and I, and I, you know I just that then then she's she's growing. She's a very good player, and she showed it tonight. Uh, let's speak a little bit about Kalija. Of course, she got uh, two yellow cards, um, but her performance overall helped the team both offense and defense. Yeah, I mean, Kadisha is our best player, and you know, obviously one of the best players in the world. So, you know, and she took some, she took a beating tonight, but she hang in there, and um, and it was um, getting a red card, which wasn't a red card when you look at when you look at the film, you know, the last one wasn't a foul. So, I mean, obviously, you know, we feel it for her right there, you know, and. I don't know what we can do about it because they're saying there's no appeal. So, but she was fantastic, and, and she's going to be with us, and we just have to do some for the next game, just retool and come again, as they say in Jamaica. Right. I'm talking about retooling. Uh, what are the options for people on out? What are the options that you have uh, in, in as far as uh, not being in the game? Yeah, we have options, you know, but obviously the option again is not Kadisha because Kadisha, Kadisha takes a crowd, you know. Kadisha is that type of player, you know. She's good on the ball, her movements is good, so 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 she draw a crowd. But we have some other players. We don't know who yet, but we will put somebody in that spot and just see how trading goes the next few days, and then then, then we'll make a choice. Right. Uh, of course, the next game against Panama. Uh, I would say this game today was our top game in terms of result, but the next one coming up would be just as important because we need to three points. Every game is important, you know, you play three games, that's why you play three games, you know. If a tie had gotten you through the World Cup and, I mean, through the first round, then we would say no, but, you know, we have to come out ready, because Panama is going to be ready, okay, you know, because as you can see, a bunch of the, um, the so-called, like ourselves, the so-called, you know, I don't know how to put it. Some of the lesser teams, put it that way, our lesser ranked teams are doing very well. So we have to be ready to play Panama. Cause Panama is going to come blazing. Now, uh, finally, what do you have to say to Jamaica? Well, I mean, our, again, it's the same thing. You know, we just, we just, we just hope that people will support this, support the team, and support women's football because you can see. That's a packed stadium tonight. And actually, a lot of people are cheering for us. A lot of people love Jamaica. So we just want all our Jamaican, native Jamaican people, whether, whether you live in Jamaica or not, or you have some Jamaican heritage in you, get on the bandwagon and start cheering for Jamaica, man, because I think it's an exciting time.